<laughs> All right. Ruben used to go by Baby Orchata, and that's because Baby Back Ribs was already taken. <laughs> that was good. <laughs> Cecilia is an Americanized Puerto Rican, which in Mexico we love to call those unseasoned pork chops. <laughs> Uh, Ruben produces his own shows. Uh, that's the only way he could become a headliner. <laughs> I gotta do it some way to say I can't suck dick like you. Oh! That's funny, uh, cause Ruben's mouth looks like a butthole with teeth. <laughs> I don't know where Cecilia has more meat, on her ass or her forehead. <laughs> she got a Peyton Manning looking forehead. That's funny, that's funny. Uh, Ruben wears his own merch because he's his only fan. <laughs> I'll send you your $4.99 later. <laughs> Cecilia looks like if I asked AI to generate me a human that claims to be Latinx and, and was born in Logan Square, but still secretly bought Starbucks while Hamas and Israel were going at it. So I just had a baby, but Ruben looks like he's expecting one. Cecilia's baby actually just turned five months old and she already knows more Spanish than her. to flat-chested women because he doesn't like anyone to have bigger boobs than him. I got bigger ones than you, dog. Oh! I think we share the same bra. Uh... Cecilia has manly feet. Not even Rob Schneider would look at those. Dan Schneider, fuck, bro. <laughs> Ruben is a celebrity, he's an actor. Uh, he uploads his own uh, short films on YouTube. That wasn't that great, I'm not gonna lie to you. <laughs> I was doing good though, right? <laughs> Wait, that was it? No, I'm not. Oh. Go. No, I'm saying like. No, you go. That you're finished. Do better. Go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't know when the joke stopped, my bad. I was interested. The other guy, the other day, my homie asked me, hey, bro, how bad has uh, Humble Park got gentrified? And the only way I could show him was I just showed him a picture of Cecilia. That's a good picture of me. <clears throat> uh, Ruben's really famous on TikTok, not from his stand-up, uh, from his Ozempic ads. <laughs> <sighs> so, Cecilia had a baby before wedlock, which means she's just gonna go to hell. But it's starting to make sense on why they say Jesus couldn't have been born in Puerto Rico, because they couldn't find three wise men and a virgin. <laughs> and that's a battle. <laughs> You want to start us off? Sure. Um, that was, you know, one more time for them for starting it off. It's hard to start off a roast battle. That was great. That was pretty good. Anyway, when you said Rob Schneider, I kind of believed that Rob Schneider was also in defeat. And he was like, Dan Schneider. I'm like, oh, but also Rob Schneider, I guess. I, that was nice. Um, that was fun. I mean, Ruben's usually like really great off the cuff. Like he's usually like such a killer. But like this time, you were reading your jokes like it was a book report your mom wrote for you. <laughs> You're like, and she's a pork chop. <laughs> Where am I? Um, that was great. I think that you had some great jokes. The Spanish baby joke was great. Gentrified joke was very fun. Uh, but butthole with teeth, man. I mean, that is. <laughs> 
That's a visual I will be remembering later alone. And I like it. And uh, Cecilia, I thought you were more consistent. Great job to both of you, but CC gets my vote. All right, one for CC, one for CC. Uh, I'm gonna go to Aaron Klein. I see you there with Mike, Aaron. Hello. Um, yeah, uh, you put respect on Deuce Bigelow, okay? We're having, we're having fun tonight, but there's a line that I draw. Uh, the butthole thing, yeah, it's, for some reason, the thin mustache almost makes it... Yeah. He's like, yeah, he's yeah, like, he forgot to wipe one more time. Uh, it was both, you guys are both, it's obvious you guys are friends, so you're going back and forth really good, but I gotta give it to Cecilia. All right, two for Cecilia. Courtney, how are you? Good, good. Hell yeah. Great battle, by the way. This is a great way to kick off the night. Uh, this was awesome. I love seeing uh, Jay and Silent Roberto on stage. <laughs> it was beautiful. Yeah. You, guys are, you guys both look like you would get two drunk and cause a scene of the Quintanilla, and I love that energy. Um, obviously, the butthole was the joke of the night. Cecilia, you were amazing. Uh, you get my vote. All right, Cecilia gets it. Yeah. I'm good, man. This was like working at Jewel again. Uh, two Hispanics going at it. Oh my god! It's like the break room. Oh yeah, heck yeah. I'm gonna have to give it to Ruben right off the top. That's my vote. One for Ruben, Ruben on the corner. Robot Hill. Yeah, yeah. He says the words, but I love this uh, Spanish Civil War going on. <laughs> I'm glad that uh, Mexicans and Puerto Ricans, we ain't told y'all that we all look at y'all as just Spanish niggas at this point. <laughs> so y'all going at it is lovely. But as far as the battle, um, I love both of y'all. Cecilia, she was more raw off the dome. Uh, homeboy, you was writing, writing your shit down. It was good, but she gaslighted your ass and told you it was good, and that was it. <laughs> you fell for it. Oh, yeah, I am good. No, nope, you lost. I give it to Cecilia. <laughs> Thanks for watching Roast Battle Chicago. If you guys want to subscribe to our channel, you get even more content, a bunch of it, hours of it for free. And you can hit that little like button down there, hit the subscribe right over here, and check out these videos right over here.